Hey guys, Mackenzie is uh, looking through comments. Yeah, it's fine. We can stop. We can watch stuff. <laughs> like you do. Um, We're filming on a Monday, so of course. <laughs> of course. I'm constantly reading all your comments, so yeah. Yeah, so if you think that we don't, we 100% do, and you've just caught someone doing it right here on camera. Typically, I like it like everything. Yeah, yeah, got a little thumbs up. Probably me because I read it. Or me, actually. Um, yeah. yeah, it's you'll 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 likely see a thumbs up, and you'll also see a little fan theory heart. Fan theory heart. Yes. Yep. 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 Um, really, but if you make a good point, absolutely, you get a thumbs. Up. Same. Yeah. And I usually am like, oh, yeah, can't argue with that. Yeah. Uh, so it happens. We read everything. We read Just everything. So you know. Yeah. Everything. <laughs> the pretty nice. We have two more episodes of Angel left. That's it. Yeah. Uh, just two episodes. He's like, oh, I'm going to check just in case. Yeah, Hi. just two. Bites and then is death. Ah. <laughs> anyway, let's get to this. Let's watch now. They didn't die yet. I thought we were going to open up with Angel and the, the world. Uh, all of them. All, oh, yeah. Bonk. No, but you can slam him into a wall. Angel. Holy for him. You're lucky that worked. Mm-hmm. Jasmine's the lie. You've no idea what she is. Yes, I do. She's mine. Connor, wait. Bring them to me. Why? Did it become necessary to explain my wishes to you? No. Just <laughs> no. boy and bring them. Thank you, Connor. <laughs> Fun. I mean, Jasmine, you really only need one if you're just gonna ask questions. I'm just saying. As an evil mastermind over here. Where's Angel? You're omniscient. You tell us. <clears throat> Connor. Please, I don't want to see that. But it's the only thing I'm good at. Creature in the sewer. <laughs> a few millennia ago, his world was not unlike yours, full of hatred and fear, war scarring its landscape. Until, let me guess, you came along and made it a paradise. Well, as much of a paradise as one could with a bunch of insects to work with. I helped them along, kicked their evolution up a few ticks. And how'd that work out for them? It was a trial run. An early experiment to work out the bugs, so to speak. <laughs> I won't make that mistake again. I know where Angel is, and I know what he's looking for. He's wasting his time. If you really believed that, you'd have killed us already. Patience. Yes, ma'am? The news people have started to arrive. Please ask them to set up in the lobby. I'll be ready to speak with them after I've eaten. Mm -hmm. After she's eaten. So it's time, is it? Too much trouble conquering a primitive dimension, wasn't it, Jasmine? Must be nice for you that we have satellites to beam your message to the rest of the world. You're not wrong. It's like, yeah. God, yeah, it's nice. Harder. You can't let her do this. She'll enslave everyone. She's not what she pretends to be. She's a monster. Cordy's blood that we put in you, it, it was supposed to break the spell, show you what she really looks like. I know what she looks like. She's beautiful. Gentlemen, please show our guests to their accommodations. This address is going to be very draining for me. While I'm feasting to build up my strength, I'm going to be out of touch with you, with everything. You'll be my eyes and ears, you understand? Yeah. If Angel so much as shows his face. What is he looking for? The unattainable. So what we just learned is that Connor's just a general asshole. He knows what she actually is. He's just like, man, it's my baby. <laughs> a long way to come, Dick. Only to Say go to therapy, but we know how that oh, works for Buffy. The way down will be much, much quicker. Thanks for the tip. Maybe I can use your body to cushion the blow. I doubt my form would provide you much protection. Are you a rock? Or are you small? Both. You. You're, you're the... High priest. 
guardian of the word. She is the light. She is the way. She is not coming back. She will. When she's through with your world. You know, maybe we're not talking about the same person here. That's why you're here, dead thing. What you've come for. The word. The name. So I don't have to ask it again. <laughs> what is it? You can take away our power, but you've already lost everything. You know what maggot face looks like and you're still big with the world? <laughs> I grew up in Gortoth. Not that important to me. What is important to you, Connor? Not us, apparently. Or his own father. What about Cordelia? She's been moved. What do you mean? Someplace safe, okay? She's taken care of, so just quit. Connor, what does Jasmine eat? What? The followers she randomly chooses to come to her room. She eats people? Oh, no. To serve men. It's to serve men. She's straight on told, Connor. She's going global. You don't think Cordy's... I hope not, but we really have no way of knowing, do we? She did, you're right. Then you know, I'm kind of in a hurry. Give me her name. Keeper! That's it? Her true name is known only by the keeper of the name. Oh, you are the keeper's keeper? I am the guardian of the word. Yeah, yeah okay. So where's this keeper of the name? <laughs> it's comedic. Minimal. Only with its last breath. Will it divulge the true name? So, hey, big guy. gotta kill it. So, it's gonna die. Name I need. But you're gonna give me your name, or... Why do they have to be naked when she eats them? I mean, who wants to eat cotton? Can we do this later? <laughs> I really hate to keep these lovely people waiting. I wanted to know... Cordelia. What did you do with her? She's exactly where I need her to be. Out of harm's way. You think I ate her. What? No. <laughs> It's all she right. kind of can read your mind. But who would put such a ridiculous idea in your head? No one. I never thought. I could never hurt Cordelia Chase any more than I could you. You're my parents. It was your love that brought me here. I understand. You miss her. You're in love. So she's still here. I had a few of my faithful move her to a secure location for her protection and under constant guard. Much as our guests downstairs are supposed to be. I'm trying to save my world. Your world. A world that doesn't care, that doesn't want you. Okay, Bugsy. You want to tell me what I'm fighting for? The boy. The woman you've already lost. The boy is what you're fighting for. But you're going to fail. You're going to lose him, too. You kind of smell like... Uh... Cordelia. I read this was her favorite perfume. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Mr. Jasmine's dad. Connor. Connor? You're the guys who moved Cordelia. Jasmine told me you two helped move her. I mean, how else would I know, right? Sorry, Connor. You're just gonna have to ask Jasmine. I'm asking you. Where's Cordy? So much effort, always struggling, trying to make things right for the boy. For Connor, why do you bother? I can see you never had kids. He will never love you. Doesn't matter. Foolish dead thing. Oh. Ah, oh, well, that'll work. And if Cordelia is so dangerous to her, why not kill her and be done with it? Because maybe she can't. Exactly. I think Jasmine may be dependent on Cordelia. She can't hurt her. Not without hurting mm -hmm. herself. But maybe Cordelia can hurt Jasmine. It's a whole lot of maybes. Maybe, but if I'm right, Cordelia might be our only hope to stop Jasmine. If we can wake her up. We have to find her first. I thought we already established that she's drawing from the mother. That was when she was still inside. I guess they're just putting that back together of like, now that she's not actually a, in within her stomach, it's still a, yeah. we still have to kill Cordy because there is a connection. Is what I'm imagining. The only people that are going to be able to get close I, to her or I, do anything like that is Connor I, or Cordy. Sorry, because but, she uh, won't hurt them. I'm not supposed to be in here and leave now, or my partner and I are going to have to get rough. Please, oh, right? Please. <laughs> See, my question is: Jasmine's still high-minded. All these people. How does she not know this is how? Not happening. Uh, sometimes her attention is. Okay, I got the, the last one she was probably eating on, but this one feels like she should know. 
feels like she, no. She's she's not uh, fully a god. And then there's this <laughs> little wiggly. She took our time eating. Time for my close up. The new beginning. Well, she'd wake up and see it. It is what you wanted, right? Why you came to me? You know, what this was all about? Protecting our baby, Jasmine, so she can be and make this world the kind of place you want it. And it is better. Not harsh and cruel, the way that Angel likes it so that he has a reason to fight. Finding reasons to fight. Like, like that's what gives their lives any meaning. The only damn thing. Says the guy that just beat up an inanimate object. Yeah, sure you're not, but sure. God, I want to rest. But I can't. It's not working, Cordy. I tried to believe. Jasmine, she's... She's bringing peace to everyone. Purging all of their hate and anger. But not me. <laughs> not me! Hmm. Isn't she beautiful? She is now. Please, please stand. This is a moment to cherish while well, just enjoying one another. Doesn't that sound nice? Jasmine's well debut. You'd think she'd request a few people to watch. Oh. Just a few people to watch them. Alone. And I want you to know everything. So I'm going to open up the floor. Jasmine? Yes, Tracy. Uh, you know my name? That's right. You have a question? You know my name. Anyone else? What can we do to show our love for you? You don't have to do anything except love one another. Although, a temple would be nice. Something massive and awe-inspiring, yet warm and nurturing, where violent behavior... To get it? Kill him! All of you, kill him now! <laughs> Right as she was about to say, violent behavior will not be tolerated. Uh -huh. Sorry. Don't. No! Please! Pay no attention! It's a lie! Please! Don't leave me! And what now the, the whole world on? believes in demons. <laughs> I don't know what. I'll tell you what it was. Or they're just it's like, I was some fancy CGI. Yeah, oh, what a fun broadcast. I'm a live broadcast. Never. Never give up. Heck yeah. Never surrender. Let's go. That's it. No, thank you. Thanks, Charles. This is what my props is all. <laughs> <laughs> little recognition. Thank you. Don't be afraid. It's Fire still me. Wins. Yeah, I think how her power works, it's like making a phone call. It's over. You've lost. I've lost. No, Angel. There are no absolutes. No right and wrong. Haven't you learned anything working for the powers? There are only choices. I offered paradise. You chose this. Because I could. Because that's what you took away from us. Choice. And look where free will has gotten you. Hey. I didn't say we were smart. I said it's our right that makes us human. But you're not human. Working on it. Leave me alone. Sorry, but can't do that. What? You've taken everything. Shut up, Grandpappy. You kill me now as if you could. Maybe not. Thousands of people are dead because of what you've done. And how many will die because of you? I could have stopped it, Angel. War, disease, poverty. How many precious, beautiful lives would have been saved in a handful of years? Yes, I murdered thousands to save billions. Our fate has to be our own or we're nothing. 
like me? Look, we've all done horrible things. All we can do is try and make up for it. It's not the world that you wanted, but maybe you could still help us make it better, even if you have lost your powers. Not all of them. Oh. Think the price was too high? You haven't begun to pay. I sacrificed everything I was to be with you. So you could rule us? Because I care. The other powers don't. Never really did. You know that's true in your heart. Shame now I gotta rip it out. You really think a little electricity would destroy me? Worth a shot. I mean, it was better than your fist. You probably should have kept that. Yeah. Go to hell. You first baby. Mm -hmm. Always the same, Dad. That's Grandpa. You get a girl, you gotta make a play for it. Connor. It's gotten full on Game of Thrones there. What? <laughs> we have to find him and Cordelia before Jasmine does. Oh my God. You still love me? Yes. Why didn't Angel just do that? You got to do with being her dad? I'm, it's okay. Yeah. It's over. Connor. 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 I don't buy it was that easy. Jasmine's dead. Yeah. Connor killed her. Um, there's something I've never seen him like this. He wasn't hurt or angry. He just killed her. And his face. It's just blank. Like he had nothing left. Angel, you really I got a bad feeling. He Listen. Given up. I think he's gonna do something. You know, he might end world peace. Well, you already took care of that. Congratulations. Uh, I feel like that was just way too simple of a way to get rid of Jasmine. Um, and it possibly could be because, like, oh, she was a rotting corpse. The only person that really could have taken her out was her dad and. Or her mom, but the mom's uh, comatose. But why couldn't Grandpa? Just because he was dead? Because technically, Grandpa would still have the same blood, but I guess supernatural means of creating Connor. Yeah, I just, I don't get it. I don't get that part. Great power comes out of overconvoluted complications, I guess. Yeah, I guess. I've reached my breaking point and now I'm just a psycho. And Angel is identifying that to everybody else and be like, he is now kind of a serial killer-esque where they just don't feel any emotion over what they're doing and yeah. blah blah blah. Yeah. So there's that. So maybe it's that. Maybe that's what next season's all about. Like, Connor has become our big bad. I liked how they explained it. It's like, dude, I was in a different dimension for forever. This doesn't face me. Obviously. And I was like, oh, okay. Uh, fine. You're right. You're right. You're right. Yep. You're right. But um, I did think at the one point where she was like, I eat people. That's when it would just be like, he's like, oh, that's probably not so great. But he even let that slide for the sake of world peace. But at the same time, if you think about it and you're thinking about it from a, a standard of, of we have war, there is strife within several different countries right now and stuff like that. If you could overlook the fact that this one thing will take a toll on several people in the location that you're at, could you accept world peace? And that's a good, it's a good moral question to yourself at the sake of everybody else's, because unfortunately he doesn't have the the happiness that comes along with it, which mm -hmm. is what we just learned and mm -hmm. uh, all this. But she still has a little bit of control over him because she could speak into his mind. It's a, it's a good moral question. Would you allow it to happen? I don't know. It's a cult with guaranteed benefit except for you might the sacrifice. Get eaten. Yes. Yeah. Uh, and that sucks, but... World peace, like she said, I'm killing thousands to save, to billions. save billions and you're actually getting that payoff. It is a guaranteed payoff. It is yeah. not one of those things that like, well, maybe she's bad and she just decides to go on a killing rampage. It's like, no, she hasn't proved to do that at all. Mm -hmm. It's just that she is doing the killing to keep herself sustained so that this goodness could happen. So it's, it's a moral question for sure. So I'm not totally mad at Connor anymore for his 
decisions. But it's still weird that it took us this long to figure it out. <laughs> There's that. What? No, I just, I love your insight. It's, it's so true. Yeah. yeah. It's like, I'm not mad at his decisions anymore, but I'm still just being like, you're just being an asshole. Why don't you just tell people? That's also very true. Angel came back from that dimension, opened up the thing, made everyone know the truth. Uh, he's lucky that that guy still had talking ability after he took off his head because he didn't know anything about those creatures. And, uh, and it was actually really wise to make it come out of that guy's mouth. Because what if he didn't remember it or couldn't pronounce it or... Oh, yeah. He's like, ah. Although with as incredible as Angel and many of the people who work at Angel Investigations um, drawing abilities are, mm, and as true. intelligent as they all are, I feel like he probably still would have remembered for the sake of plot. It was almost Medusa-like in taking out the big um, Leviathan beast, mm -hmm. you know, just kind of. Instead of instead of snake hair, it's uh, I say the word and take you down. Yeah. But it was nice that it wasn't just her m sadly walking alone, all like miserable and without her powers. She was without the main source of her powers, but she still had the crazy strength and very and she was very, uh, very, uh, I was going to say full of endurance. Um, but yes. Yeah. yeah, there there was half a second I thought we were going to have Cordy die off or something, um, or when, something happened when they couldn't find her, that sort of thing, or when they said you could join the side of us and blah 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 blah. And she's unfortunately with TV shows and several things, it is you have to be a good looking demon if you're going to be a good guy. You know what I mean? So like we have Lauren, and Lauren is a good looking demon. Well. Like, not to go in the Buffy verse, but uh, Clem. Oh, that's true. <laughs> Clem is the obsession, exception to the rule. <laughs> I'll take it. But most of the time, most of the time, usually, especially if yeah. they're going to join the main cast. Yeah, we want pretty people on screen to look yeah, at. So yeah, so I, I should have put two and two together of like, oh, she's probably never going to be a main character. But it would have been cool. To have had her be a main character. It would have, honestly, it would have been really cool because Gina Torres is amazing. Now I can talk to the thing that everybody wants me to say about. Lila's back. I didn't have a huge reaction to it. Yes, it was 100% unexpected. I did not expect her to come back. Why? <laughs> There's no way I can spoil by saying you are correct. That is the proper question to have. Yeah. Yeah. I don't really see anything except for Cordy killing her being something that ties her to the main storyline. So that has to be something, maybe? Maybe. You will see. <laughs> well, it has to do with the big ending because uh, we've only got one episode left of the season. So we'll see. Mm -hmm. Answers will be had. Sure. They will. I assure you. All right, guys. Well, this was another great episode of We Watch Slayerverse with Angel. And it's laid. <laughs> That was another one down! It sure was. Another one closer to the end. Yes, <laughs> and we're this much closer to that one point that you guys have all been waiting for. And so. me too. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Make sure you like, subscribe, notify. And check us out on Patreon. That's important. For very, sure. Very, very.